Today, policymakers of the new power party decided on a new chairman. They chose legislator Xu Youming, who announced that he was open to an alliance with the DPP in 2020. The new chairman said he wanted to see his party get at least one million votes in the legislative election. He also brushed off a jab from Taipei Mayor Ke Wenzhe, who said the new power party had reached the end of its road. I'm willing to serve as party leader mainly because of Xian Zhu's wishes as he expressed in his Facebook post yesterday. Moving forward, the new power party will continue along the path Xian Zhu so resolutely forged. Today, the new power party tapped legislator Xu for chairman. Observers say the party's hawkish faction has seized the helm, narrowing the chances of a partnership with the DPP in 2020. But today, the new chairman expresses goodwill toward the ruling party. I am open to interactions with the DPP and other political parties. That's a policy first taken up by Xian Zhu. I hereby make it known that I'm ready at all times to talk things over, and I'll do it as many times as necessary. But factional division and war Outs by members mean that the new power party could be in a pickle. What epiphany can we glean from the example of the new power party? That political parties rise fast and fall fast. Previously, legislator Hong Ziyong warned that the new power party would lose lawmaker seats thanks to Ke's Taiwan People's Party. Ke replied that the new power party was capable of losing the seats on its own with no help from him. Our performance record in the legislative UN that already distinguishes us from the Taiwan People's party. It's something they don't have. What they must learn from others is how to pick nominees who turn the legislative UN into the true voice of the people. Xu said his goal for the party was to win one million votes in 2020, up from the 700,000 votes in the 2016 legislative election.